Hello guys, today I'll show you on how to do a Final Cut Pro 10 countdown in 2 minutes. So you go to generators and find time code, put it on the timeline. As you can see, you can adjust the size, the color, and also the font and the format and double click on the time in the middle for one minute just type one full stop full stop and it's done however it's not exactly one minute so you might drag it longer just like this and it's done after that you can go back to the inspector and delete away the project label if you are not satisfied with the current position you can always change the y axis and the x axis to make it better and then press option G to create a compound clip. Press command R for this speed bar to appear and then go to custom and then put reverse. And you see it's counting down from one minute. If you're creating a countdown for just 10 seconds, it's the same for the previous steps. And then you go to compound clip and create a reverse clip. After that, it's very simple. You can go to crop and then drag it a little bit like this to make sure the seconds are the only ones remain in the frame so it's clean and neat and then after that you can adjust the position and then the scale of it and it's done you see it's counting down from 10 yeah it's quite cool and then if you are using this on another clip and you see there is a black box behind it it's very simple, you just go to Compositing Blend Mode and choose Subtract if you want to have a black one or choose Lighten if you want a white one but this only apply if you use the white color I'm not sure about the other colors but this is what I use and it's done That's all for today's video, hope you guys enjoy it and please subscribe Thank you, bye bye